Hello there, and welcome to a brand new channel on YouTube. This is just going to be, uh, well, I was going to say brief then, it probably won't be very brief. It's, a, it's my first video, so I thought I'd do an introductory video to my channel. Now, I am Hastings, the man behind Hastings Gaming, funnily enough. I thought I'd do uh, a little challenge for me, just so you can see how absolutely terrible I am at absolutely everything and how I act when I'm sort of in a bit of a muddle. I thought that might be quite entertaining and along the way I'm going to try and do it in sort of a Q&A format so just so that you can sort of get to know me. I'd, I'd love to do a proper Q&A but obviously there's no one to give me any cues so I thought I've got a few notes in front of me there's a few things I can tell you about me and we'll just go from there basically. I'm sat here in a Jaguar XJ220, which is one of my favourite cars of all time, bar, I don't know, maybe a few actually, but um, it is one of my favourite cars ever. I, I, I genuinely could not pick one car to say that's what I want, because I'm a, I'm a massive petrol head and so many things I love. This is right up there. I mean, this for me, I'd rather have over probably McLaren F1, Ferrari Enzo. You know, this for me, I, I really like the GTR, the Nissan GTR, the the new one, the R35, and that, that's very nice. And I, the BMW M3 as well, obviously not quite so performance. Performance. Um, and, um, and, 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 hmm. Yeah, it's an introductory video. You can already see that I'm very bad at thinking of words on my feet. But yes, the M3 isn't as performance spec. It's a different type of vehicle, but I still, it's a car that I really, really like. Um, yes, this challenge, I've been talking and waffling for quite a bit. I'll try and not do that so much in the future. I am here in my Jag, as I have said, on Forza Horizon 2. And if we take a look at the map, you can see that I am right in the top right-hand corner. You may have also noticed that on my screen I have no mini-map, which means I can have no set route. I am going to try and navigate my way to there, down at the docks, without any aid at all. And to make it just slightly harder, I'm not allowed to use the motorway either. So let's kick it off, and I will, uh, I will kick into the first point that I've got. That's a brilliant start, stalling it. <laughs> yes, first thing. What is the first thing that you should probably know about me? Um. Well, I guess the first thing you see on my channel is my name, so maybe I should maybe I should explain that. Oh, the dirt road. No, let's, let's stick to the time for now. My name, Hastings Gaming. Um, many people that I meet assume that Hastings is actually my real name. Obviously not my first name, but my surname. Um, and many people think, and that's understandable, but Hastings is just a nickname that I've picked up. Just sort of meeting through other people. Um, yeah, it's just it's about, it's about it, really. <laughs> Uh, my gamer tag is Jamjar Hastings, and Jamjar is a is another nickname I picked up, a very juvenile nickname. I must point out, I had it, I, I had it sort of given to me, sort of given to me. People used to call me Jamjar when I was about sort of ten years old, sort of the latter end of primary school. And Hastings is what everyone calls me now, how my peers address me. So that's my gamer tag, that's my name on on YouTube. So yeah, that's that was. A lot briefer than I had it planned out, to be honest. I don't really know what else I can say about that. But um, I'm trying to think what else you can, what else I can tell you. I'm on the motorway. I'm cheating. Get off. Is, it, is this off? Or am I might have to do some cross There's some. There's some. There's, yeah, it's all right. This is this is the exit. I'm I'm suddenly realised that I've already lost complete and utter sense of direction. Absolutely completely. But that's not too much of an issue. I think I'm sort of heading of the balloons of the festival and I need to go sort of past that and west of it, I think. Not that I've got a compass, but I can sort of hopefully use the horizon to sort of guide me in the right direction. Um, yeah, I thought it'd be a brilliant idea to tell you about me. I thought I can tell you all about my name. That's literally like five minutes worth of video and I've already done like an entire introduction. And told you all about my name, which I thought was going to last a bit longer. Than it was. Um, yeah, I'm completely new to uh, to YouTube. I just thought I'd give it a go. Um, 
I record with an Ava Media LGP Lite capture card on the Xbox One. I will be solely doing Xbox One videos until I can sort of figure out how to set it up to record off my laptop or my computer and then maybe we can have a look at some uh, Steam games in the future. I do have a 360 as well, but I don't really have many games on that and it's not set up or anything, it's just sort of in storage at the moment, so I could possibly bring that out, but it's it's not likely to uh, feature any time soon. Um, my channel will be based around this sort of thing. I'm, I'm quite a competitive racer. I, I love racing on I love racing games. Uh, Forza Horizon 2 is it's kind of like, it's one of it's more laid back in terms of my, my personal preference from my perspective, as it were. I'm much more of a sort of Forza 5 type of guy. I just oh now where am I? Yeah, Forza 5. I'm, I'm normally more sort of circuit racing oriented. I'm really looking forward to project cars coming out at the end of March. That's a road, and I shouldn't have gone off-roading because that's made me very stupid. Because I don't know if I'm north or south of the festival. I've come down from that way, have I? So I think I need to go this way. And then sort of left up here to go past the festival. And then right to go down to the bottom of the bottom. I don't know. I should have been paying more attention. Let's let's take that road. Brakes aren't oh, broken. Let's go. Uh, this is completely stopped, in case you're wondering. I haven't done any upgrades at all, but it's still very, very fast. Yes, I, I plan on doing a uh, bit of a follow-up video to this at some point, a proper Q and A. So if you've got any questions for me, I'm um, things that I don't cover, which at the moment seems to be quite a lot of things, because I've covered barely anything. Um, yeah, let's just go straight through the first one. Why not? So yeah, that's another thing that I've said. Yay! Ask me questions, please. I want lots of views on my videos. I'm not going to get the... I'm, no, I'm not taking YouTube too seriously. Um, like I said, I've, uh, I've already recorded quite a few videos. I think I've got about a week's worth. Um, and to be honest, I, was, I wasn't I was really planning on uploading them to YouTube. I was just making them a bit of a hobby. I quite enjoyed the editing. Um, I don't edit massively well. I just use, uh, at the moment, I just use Windows Movie Maker to sort of cut them in and uh, use some of the uh, functions on there. But I just think it's quite entertaining. It doesn't take me a massive amount of time, but I can quite commit to it. Where's the festival? Where's the festival? Oh, okay, I think I'm still going in the right direction. And I've stalled it again. Yes, that's probably a... I don't know why I'm changing up. I'm stalling it. That's just ridiculous. That's quite useful, actually, because that'll lead me on to my next topic. Um, which I had forgotten that I'd thought about. And that's... I'm assuming you're probably wondering what sort of assists are you on? How, how serious is this guy? Um, I tend to run with most assists turned off, but I'm not a, I'm not a robot. I'm not that quick. I'm not that serious. I'm, I take it... I take it... Well, okay, that was going to sound... I was going to say I'm not that serious at it, about it, but I take it quite seriously, which is a complete and utter contradiction. No, I don't take it massively seriously, but I am by nature pretty competitive. So, I like to use the assists that I think are going to make me quickest, because I'm not a particularly quick driver and I need all the help I can get. Ooh, I think I'm quite close to the docks already, actually. If I am where I think I am, this video might be a lot shorter than I expected. Yes, so the actual specific assists, I'm getting off topic incredibly easily. But yes, I run ABS on because I... I don't know, really. I, it's easier to just sort of slam the brakes on and not have to worry about it locking up than it is to sort of really have to control the brakes. Um, I run traction control and stability control, all of them completely turned off. And I think this is going to be really boring now because I can just follow the post into the box. And I'm terrible at changing gear. Well not thinking about changing gear. And that leads me very neatly on to my next assist, which is the gears. I run manual with clutch, but I don't run the default uh, button configuration. I use A as my clutch, so I can hold that with sort of the base of my thumb while I flick either gear up or gear down, which I have on X and B. Wait, which way around do I have it? Okay, B's gear up for me. 
I know, I mean, I know someone that runs it the other way around, and that's just that would baffle me. I suppose I've been running sort of it this way around for quite a while, so. But yeah, each to their own. I mean, I don't take assists into account really. I mean, run what assists are comfortable to you. I've got friends that run full assists. I've got run. I've got friends that run zero assists, and we can have some incredibly close, fun racing, and that's what I enjoy at the end of the day. I enjoy it slightly more if I win, but you know that doesn't always happen. I don't. I don't mind too much if I if I had a really good battle. Um, I'm, I'd like to think I'm quite a gracious loser if I've had a really fun battle, but. I, I don't know really. <laughs> I guess sometimes I can be a bit of a sore loser. But yeah, you'll, you'll find that out. In, we'll, we'll do many a races on this channel and you can see quite how I act in sort of those different scenarios. Um, I'm trying to think, are there, any, are there any other assists I haven't talked about telling you if I have them on or off or not? If in doubt, I probably have them off. Um, I do use, on Forza 5 for the circuit races, I use Breaking Line. Not 100% of the time, especially if it's a track I don't like, I tend to have it on. But the thing is, I normally turn it on and then forget to turn it off again, so I do, I do use that. And again, that's with the braking. I'm not that good at racing, like I've said a few times, so... I drive flat out to, to the braking point and then just slam the brakes on and don't have to worry about them locking up and I'm being told when to brake as well. Is that the dog's over there? Oh, it's round the coast. Let's go find out. So yeah, uh, that's my brakes sorted. Oh, the steering. That uh, that that depends as well. I'll, I'll turn it on to normal, and then I'll think, yeah, this is sort of a bit overcorrected for my liking, so I'll stick it on to simulation, and then I'll try and drift, and I can't drift on simulation. So I'll go and stick it back on normal, and then I think, oh, that's not responsive enough, so I'll stick it back on simulation again. And it's a never-ending cycle, so I could be running either or at any given time. I haven't even got a clue what I'm using now, to be honest. Um, judging by that drift that I just failed at, I'd probably guess simulation steering. Actually, I don't even know if there is stimulation. Stimulation. That's a different word. Uh, simulation steering on Horizon 2, but it, it, it could be. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm not that indulged in it, to be honest. So, yes, we appear to be getting quite close to the docks now, but I'm pretty sure I said that a few minutes ago. And I'll bug on my PC is running low battery as well. This is not going particularly smoothly. Let's hope that's not a sign of things to come on my, hopefully, uh, YouTube career. I call it a career because I hope that it lasts more than a few weeks. Um, I tend to have a, a quite sustainable attention span for running projects like these. So, oh, I was, I was, I was hand gesturing, and I took my hand off the controller. That's why I crashed. I know, racing driver, racing driver excuses. But yeah, I, I tend to talk with my hands quite a lot, which is a, is a big challenge for me. I'm trying to drive while... Ooh! I'm trying to drive and think what I'm saying and talk and think about not using hand gestures when I talk because that will make me crash. My, my control is all, up, all over the place. It's like I'll pick it up and make double-handed hand gestures with the controller in hand. Um, yeah, it's quite funny. I, I find it much easier to record post comms or post commentaries but they take a lot longer and they're not and that's why I guess they're slightly more fun to edit but they're quite annoying because oh, have I stopped myself around in a circle? Yeah post commentaries are quite annoying to do because um, I think my lap laptop might be slightly slow so it tends to buffer the video clips at a different rate to the audio clips so I end up getting lag and they don't sync up and it's really horrible so it's much easier. And I guess, in a, in a way, it's more fun doing it like this, because you get, ooh, bloody hell, you get, you get pure reaction from me. And I get to bugger it up and not give a damn. <laughs> but, okay, I think it's the third time lucky. No, that's not the docks, I can say we're close to the docks. I'm just going to follow the coast. I hope I'm going in the wrong direction. I'm, yeah, I'm definitely going in the right direction, because that's south, that's west. I do know geography-ish. Yeah, um, if anything more about me you should know. Oh, um, just one final sort of link off from the assists that I use. Um, I don't normally race in third person view. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, got a bit of a sore throat there. Not sore throat, just a fucking frog in me throat. Or, uh, it's, a, it's an old saying, frog in me throat. I think I've heard it before. I haven't just made it up. 
Anyway, frog in me throat. Frogs are green, cars green. Ah, yes, third person view. <laughs> I find that, or in my opinion, from videos that I've watched in the past on YouTube and in the present and probably in the future, it's my opinion that. I've said that twice, haven't I? But it is my opinion <laughs> that uh, watching a video that's been recorded with a drive in third person is more entertaining and just maybe it's a it's slightly better quality. That is the docks! I'm really close, yay! Maybe I'll drift around the docks a bit while I finish this off. It's more entertaining because you can see more of what's going on. You can see if there's a car pulling alongside me. If I'm racing competitively, I'm quite happy to race in cockpit view. Um, not the best idea sometimes with cars that I don't know the like dimensions of. Like this car is a lot wider and a lot longer than a lot of other cars. So it's not necessarily the best idea for me to try and drift it in first person. And I've stalled it in reverse again. Ooh, let's run backwards. How quickly can we go in reverse? 40. There's a wall there. Ooh, 68 miles an hour and I'm chickening out. I'm sure this is a lot further away than it looks on my screen right now with the panic of the J-turn. Yeah, back here. we got we got plenty of room. And I've stalled it again. I've, oh, I'm having a real off day here. Um, yeah, I thought I'd drift around the docks a bit, but this car doesn't seem to want to drift, and I can't think of anything else really to say. Like I have already said, I, I know I've repeated myself so much in this video, I, I do apologise for that. Um, like I said earlier, I will hopefully do a follow-up video to this at some point with, some, with a proper Q&A, so you can actually ask me questions, and you'll hear stuff about me. Um, there may be a slight weird edit in the video about now. I've just made a very, very obvious rookie error. I said earlier in the video that my computer's battery was running low and it ran out and cancelled the recording. Um, I do have pretty much all the footage. So, I think a minute ago you heard me about to say, leave your questions for me in the comments section below because I will be doing a follow-up video to this with proper questions um, with answers to those questions so instead of me just rambling on you will you will find out things about me that you actually want to know and you'll obviously do that by leaving questions in the comments down below as I've said and I'm going back to the hand gestures thingy that I said about earlier I'm moving around all over the place and I've, oh, I've had an absolute mare this video I really do hope that my personal quality will improve and hopefully make my videos a better, better quality through that. Even then, I just, I just mispronunciation of words, not being able to think of words, things like that. Hopefully, I will get better at with time. I'm aware that you're sort of just sat looking at a picture of my car again now, which is still suitably dirty. Um, it was terrible at drifting anyway, so you, didn't, you really didn't miss much. And I was literally going to say, I'm going to finish off with... And then I can't remember what I was going to, what I was going to finish off with, but I do remember that I was going to throw this car as fast as I possibly could at the ramp down the end over here and launch it into some trees. I can't think of anything else, but I'll see you for the next video. Hastings out. Goodbye. And I've managed to miss all the trees. Yay!